<laughs> That's so crazy. I can't say bad words. <laughs> Look at this one. This is beautiful. And I mean that really sincerely. I love how they look at, again, you want to look at the doors and all of this business. Now, here's the thing about doing public art. And the other part of this is, like you said, sanctioned, which means that they went through quite a bit of process to make sure that, that you know, they're not going to damage the electrical, that, you know, whoever is in these uh, buildings won't come out this way. Even the paint they use, whether it's spray paint, traditional house paint has to be a part of it because you know we still want to be responsible we still want to make sure we also want to make sure this stuff lasts a minute it is outside and you know <laughs> you know we did have a bad nasty snowstorm we want to make sure that yeah. this works well, and this is Oklahoma especially in Oklahoma where the, where the temperatures can be so extreme I'm surprised it's so bright at the bottom right you could assume that snow would probably Snow and, other stuff. and it might be kind of cool. I mean, y'all, y'all are looking at. I mean, everybody signed their name. You do want to sign your work. I love this. Looks like the Cheetos, dude. The kinda. Cheetos. You're asking for us. So, and especially these, I, I'm really kind of, I'm almost really fascinated with the with these fence, just because again, you have that added that added layer of, of, of complication by having to incorporate this type right here. Your question, you know, did they, <laughs> did they project this out? I mean, it'd be interesting to see the process. How did they draw it out? Did they have a projection? I mean, they went out a projection. That's okay. Um, you know, using, painting all of this, it, it, it kind of makes it look a little bit more interesting. Joe skills. <laughs> it's a lovely. How long did it take them to paint this? Well, probably, depending on when they started and how many people were on there. They may have. A lot of these guys have crews, so they may have had people helping them out. Um, it's Fiona. I don't know if Fiona is somebody at. Well, the little at sign I'm assuming is the artist tag, oh. their handle. On Twitter and on Instagram and any other You're social media. Guys. Excuse me. Tony Thunder. I've heard of him. Um, the reason why I'm really wanting to look, because the people who are actually in the class, you three, which is Callie, Preston, and Taylor, I, uh, you guys, you know, you have, <laughs> y'all the one getting the grades, so y'all need to try to design. But I also want you to see, it doesn't have to be a subjective thing. Does that make sense? It doesn't have to be, it can be very colorful. It is for the, it's for the communication center. Um, well, I was trying to say, in the humanities building, we have two murals that is all about humanities, right? And that's fine. Well, um, bless our humanities building, they have gone through quite a bit. As I told Debbie, remember, I said, they're trying to get rid of two and an R and a Z Massive and an R. creation. What yeah, what's up with oh, the dollar like sign? He's the freaking pole. He's why does, the pole. Why did you say R and that one says, like, the other side is, like, two, I Z? I don't know. I don't understand what he's holding, though. What he's holding yeah. in his other hand? Looks like a phone. Looks like a... Like a phone. That might be a phone. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Well, I mean, these are kind of art artists for life. I mean, you gotta love. <laughs> People love art. I tell you what. Now, this is a cool little bar I came to the last time. I, I told you, it's a cool little divey bar. I love. Don't put that on. <laughs> Edit it out. <laughs> I love it. Don't know. I'm grown. Really, I'm a grown ass man. I go to the bar. 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 I go to the I go to the I think she's the first black female who actually got to able to do her own thing here at the mural. And this is one of her 
wonderful design. She does this beautiful, colorful design. I was going to say I love the color. Right. And then this is uh, Jay Farrell, who definitely his work is inspired by Afrocentric symbolism. Uh, and actually some of his work is at La Braza, which is on Classen and Brazilian food steakhouse. It's really good. <laughs> so, but he did some work, and he's been doing work. He he's been doing work throughout here in Oklahoma, as well as other parts of the country. And so these are beautiful works that they did. And I mean, I love showing. Like I said, this is definitely a great example of showing you design work and what can be accomplished. Maybe something again. For any of those, you know, when you're drawing out your mural, think about this. Think about, you know, images. Uh, I mean, just simple design. I shouldn't say simple. But design and pattern and texture and all of that. I mean, it's still just as powerful and just as Um, So this is some uh, over here. And I think most of, I think we're going to go, let's see if we can go across the street. Now, there's, of course, that mural right there. Now, there's murals, and then there's kind of logos. <laughs> if somebody has, if you, let's say a business wants to have you paint something, they want to do a mural, but they want you to do their logo. <laughs> there is, depending on who you are, some people think that there's a difference. I don't know. There's window, window art, excuse me. She did, so Remember? you are the... Oh, yeah, you're not a decorated there. Parallel. Window. Like the big window in oh, that that is and yeah. that was in that And yeah, it, it took days. Oh my gosh, it took forever. I know people who... Wait a minute, girl opens at noon. I love oh, bad grannies. Oh, look, she's wearing a mask. No. Love look, it. Look, oh, she's wearing a mask. Is it open? No, it's not open until noon. Oh. You got about three minutes. Oh, yeah. Um... I'll just say it's not legal to jaywalk in Oklahoma, by the way. That's because nobody knows. Yes. <laughs> and if you do, we're like it's like it's like a spot. Right. I love telling people I say you can't really talk about walking I said, okay, here's the thing about it. You know how we love to call ourselves an energy stage. So they want to do And we all walk. I like the spoopy birds. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, oh yeah. I have to drive it and this like Oh my god. Oh yeah, let's just make everybody come out. You said your friend made this one? Yeah, my friend Skip Hill, well, who I've known for many moons. He lives in Tulsa, but he did this last summer. I didn't get a chance to come down and visit with him because I don't see him because he lives in Tulsa. But this is one of his work at Skip Hill. You can probably find him online. And then this is the Holy Kids, a holy as an H-O-L-E-Y. I've actually seen some of the stuff they do. They're kind of like three, they're like three people, three folks, and they wear masks. They wear masks. Uh, so you, you don't know who they are, even though I'm pretty sure people know who they are. Uh, they do performance, but they also do a lot of you know, co uh, collaborative work that work with each other. So I guess this is theirs. Yeah. So I reckon, I know these two. I've seen their work, uh, and then here we have some good stuff. Actually, I was in a show with them. That's it. I was in a show with them at a place called Current Studio, which used to be off of Northwest 10th Street, uh, which kind of evolved into, which kind of went out and then it evolved into Factory Obscuria, which used to be down there, and now it's off on Broadway, off of Broadway. I'll be in the way. But yeah, I just kind of love, you know, I love both of these works. Oh, I like this simplicity. I like, I love how he's using the black to create the black, the white stuff, <laughs> the black birds, the negative space. So any questions? I mean, we looked at, we looked at these murals. I wonder, is there any more? There are murals over, are there murals down here? I don't think so. I don't think so. There's it, murals right there. The weird oh, fat yeah. bee murals. Oh yeah, yeah, this mural. Okay. I knew there was at least a couple of them pretty close to us. Oh, you're right. I need to get a lottery ticket. I might go over to this. I need know, to get a lottery ticket. Somebody in Oklahoma like two or three weeks ago 